Oh my god, it feels amazing. It's like 50 degrees, right babe? Oh my goodness, in February. This is a great February. Thanks, Phil. Punks Tony Phil, as you can see in that last episode a couple days ago. So today was an interesting day, surprise-wise. <laughs> I found this person and I decided to take ownership of him. It's like a stray dog, if you will. I like chicken. It's very, uh, it's very sexist. <laughs> Not just men like chicken. Women like chicken too, okay? Well, it's good. You can see it. JC, back at the shot. Vlogging. The vlog. Vlog. Video you vlog. Been, you been keeping on? Oh yeah. Keeping sure. up with it? Oh yeah, keeping up with the video vlog. More with featured guests here soon. Tell people what you did today. Here, you can hold the camera while I'm looking for the stuff for What did I do today? What did I do today? Why are you here? Why am I here? Training. First day of the job. Luxury apartments, you know. <laughs> Only the highest thing. Today I met ooh, Tom Brady. Tom Brady? Yeah. Did you really be? Yeah. It's like Tom. <laughs> Listen, man. You just won your fifth ring. I mean, not that one. You're going to want to move to Chicago. That's all he said? Yeah. He's got a sound advice. Yeah, sound advice. This Tom Brady guy, is he an actor? I mean, they're comparing him to Michael Jordan now, so... Yeah, right. Might as well come to the shy and really prove. The latest <laughs> real estate broker. Yeah. This is Tom. You gotta move out to the shy, man. Um, I believe him, too. Surprised my boy Jake with the call that was in town. Uh, a, a surprise. I was... I started crying. A tears. A tears. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so I got that. That's legit. That's straight. Let's um, let's figure out this food situation. So we kind of know where to go. Food situation. Food situation. Thank you. So I got that. That's legit. That's straight. Let's um, let's figure out this food situation. So we kind of know where to go. Food situation. Food situation. Thank you. Norman's not gonna be home until eight or nine. She said. So we gotta figure out food situation. Man. The food situation. Tell them what you want. Chicken. Don't say chicken. They better have a chicken. It's over. It is over. Yeah, so basically Chicago is more Chicago is more manageable. I think. I think Chicago is just way more manageable than New York. Right. Not as stressful. Yeah. Yeah, the stress level can vary on the person too, but you know, in general, I think it's less stressful here than the New York. Inner, newer, Midwestier. Yeah, that's a word. Midwestier, Midwestier, right here. Okay. Yep. Uh, uh, I heard you know these words mean. <laughs> it's good though, guys. <laughs> it, it, it's good, guys. guys. Chihuahua is delicious. Guys. It's good though. Guys, <laughs> it just says guys, guys. Guys, relax, come back. It's like, we know it's delicious, thank yeah. you. It's, it's, like, it's like, like a mix of couscous with like, Maybe not, I don't know. I can't remember what shawarma is. Got bubba ganoush. So, it's all shawarmas. <laughs> J Law and uh, what's his face? J Law and Chris Pratt, what do you think? Uh, you know? Basement, I think. I think they're kind of. I love them as people and as actors, love their work. But as passengers, they said they're just kind of dialing it in. Can't wait till the day I can dial in and make. Twenty million dollars. <laughs> That's the day we all we all wait for. Right. Be like, look, we're gonna make a movie mm -hmm. from home. Sure. Several million dollars. Several, several million dollars. Several million. Several. Oh, several. several. Many. Many millions is good. Many billions <laughs> of <A> dollars. dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I have many. 
many, many, many billions. billions. <laughs> <laughs> that's what. That's what we're waiting on. Yeah. Good. It's got to be depressing. It's a few days of life. Is this the car? A few days of life. Is it upstairs? We gotta get Jeremy to Union Station. Union Station, right? Uh, it's a uh, canal and pull up, pretty much. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. So we're not late for Jeremy's bus. Right. We were thought we were because it left at eight o'clock and we were like leaving at seven fifty. I blame Chris Pat and Jennifer Lawrence. Blame them too. We were passengers. Analyzing. What are you guys doing? Yeah, we were we were analyzing the performances. You mean lack thereof. <laughs> So the bus isn't here yet. We asked some people and there's still some people waiting around here. There's like really no number that they can call for the mega bus. It's like right. you literally just have to wait. Oh, they're le they're leaving? There's other people waiting now behind us. So we don't look shady. A Hispanic dude and a black dude no. in a black car. No. Nope. With no Wait, hold on. There you go. Now it's shady. <laughs> Shadier than slim. Whoa, that was really close yeah, to our car. Close, Holy crap. What are you doing, truck? And this week I'm going to go back to my apartment uh -huh. in St. Louis, finalize packing and getting all that squared away. Come back to Chicago, start working this weekend. That's amazing. You're going to be busy. <sighs> yeah. Oh, I'm looking for apartments. Here, I haven't found a place yet. So yeah, he's moving here this weekend. Even though that's my job. <laughs> right, exactly. Oh, there they are. Oh, there we go. Mega bus. Mega bus. Buses. Not just the regular bus, but the mega kind. There you are. There you go. The thumbnail right here. Right there. Thumbnail. Sure. I'm a man. Absolutely, man. You're good to go. Everybody say bye to him. See you soon. Literally soon, like mm -hmm. this weekend soon. Bro. My oh, man, boy. be safe, bro. Thanks a lot. No too. problem. Glad we I'm made it. Sure. Sure. Fast and furious to the streets of Chicago. Not through red lights or anything. We're literally <laughs> going through green lights. All right, my bro. Dude, let me know when you get back. For sure. Send me a text or whatever. Right? Oh, all right, I miss you. He just doesn't look shady at all. Later, man. Have a safe trip. Oh yeah. Good job. <laughs> what if I just died right there? That'd be horrible. Good. We did not arrive late. That is good news. Good. Successful driving service by David. Hey, everybody. Right, but David. Did you download that David app? No, I haven't, but I should. I hear David's the best. He's amazing at driving. Oh, I know, right? Yeah, totally. Yeah, but I don't know. He likes to make weird puns. Yeah, but I kind of like him. You like him? Oh, we're not friends anymore. What do you mean we're not friends anymore? We've been friends since third grade. Yeah, but I hate you. I hate the way you make puns. I guess what I'm trying to say is that I don't like puns. You don't like puns very well, do you? No, I don't really like puns. I, I, th I think I should have told you that in fourth grade or so. Maybe fifth grade at, at most. But, um... Yeah, yeah, you probably should have told me before I, uh, before I invited you to my wedding. You know? Yeah, so... Well, this is where we part ways. It's nice knowing you. I wish you... Wish you the best. Yes, yes, you too. I, uh, have your contact information. I have your contact... Information, so... Put, put it there. Goodbye, goodbye. That wasn't Jeremy's bus. That was not Jeremy's bus. He was supposed to get on one that had left like maybe one or two minutes prior. So what are y'all doing? You can't make a right on- Yeah, so I'm gonna go get him because he's just standing in the middle of the street, cold and probably naked. It's, it's a little bit, uh, scary these days but so i'm gonna go get him because he can't go to st louis tonight and and that's that's funny now it will be funny in the future and that sucks now technically i guess poor guy that's my fault i shouldn't have kept him at home watching stupid movies stupid j-law
sure me somewhere around here, evidently. Let's see where he's at. Called Jeremy's Land. That's not him running here. Yeah, it's him right here. Not shady at all. Hi, Anna. Oh, welcome back. The blog continues. <laughs> Dude, I'm sorry. It's all good. Oh my god. At least we can watch the It's oh. all good. Everything happens to the voice buster. I honestly didn't I feel guess. like doing that epic right back right there. <laughs> <laughs> and Jeremy's back. And I'm back. And he's back. So, uh, false alarm. Going to St. Louis. So don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We know we had you on the edge of your seats and you wanted more. On the cusp. <laughs> on the cusp. Of oh, thrill. <laughs> you so, smell like smoke. Yeah, I smoked a cigarette. Yeah, you should have. Yeah. It's like sex. A missing a bus. A <laughs> Well, welcome back. back. Hey, yeah. I basically just wanted to give Jeremy a ride to a random bus stop, mm -hmm. leave him there, sure, and then, mm -hmm. and then go get him again. Social experiment. It was a social experiment. Now, our question to you is: Was I being racist by doing this? <laughs> that wasn't racist. But when you lit the cross on fire. <laughs> That just did it. <laughs> that about did it. Pretty much made it. Right. That pretty much. T -t 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 time to leave. <laughs> and then she said, "What is that? My waffle?" <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, waffles! Right. I know, right? You, oh, you wouldn't man. expect That's that. That's crazy, dude. That's stupid. That was a good one. She's stupid. That was a good one. Yeah. Her <laughs> We're gonna go pick up here on me because she's just getting out of work. Poor thing at 11 p.m. Poor girl. Slavery, right? Uh, we've all been there, you know me. <laughs> we've all been there. Yep. So you'll see her in a little bit. She's adorable. She's my wife. You probably have seen her before. Yeah. Like whatever. Hey, girl. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> I need a hug! <laughs>